So there's always like hundreds and thousands of different settings you can use in Apex Legends when it comes to ALC settings. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you the sort of one to two sliders that you could be using in the ALC settings that give you sort of like an aimbot-ish type of look. Now, obviously it doesn't give you aimbot, but it gives you the visual representation of what it looks like to snap on to an enemy and uh it, it almost looks like you're cheating it, it's very interesting so if you enjoy the the content the the settings let me know i'll show you uh what it looks like here and uh let's let's just get into it further so all we're gonna do do here is just in firing range we have the dummies and everything moving here uh so alc settings if you go into there you can copy these if you want all of these settings that you're seeing here on your screen aren't the important ones, um, but just for this instance, I have a two dead zone, a one outer, response curve zero. If if you care about paroptic settings, this is what I'm currently using. Yaw, speed, pitch speed, again, the, these aren't the important settings, but what is the important setting is right here, the ADS turning extra yaw pitch and ADS turning extra pitch. Now, why is this the important setting? If you juice these guys all the way up to max, what this is gonna do is when you're ADS, having this at max is as soon as you, as soon as the edge of your stick hits that threshold, it's gonna put the additional 250 onto it, and what is that gonna do? It's gonna it's gonna make your aim move all around like so. And then when you counter that or pair that, I should say, with aim assist, you're here, you're here, you're looking all around, and then you 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 snap onto an enemy. Look how fast that can snap on. If you're a player that tends to aim in before seeing an opponent, this is where it's going to benefit you the most. This isn't the best setting in the world. It's just kind of fun to use, and I just wanted to share that with you here today. So, for instance, you're over here, you could just quickly snap onto the opponent. It's ridiculous how accurate this is because, again, we all know how insane aim assist the power is in this game. So when you're here and then you, you get onto it, it slows down drastically. I'll try and get an example here. So, like, we're moving, we're, and it just slows down right by him. Look at that. So that's kind of what it means, like how it can give you that that aimbot sort of visual feel. Again, it's not absolute aimbot, but it does slow it does slow your aim down quite a drastic amount to where you can snap on to someone. And uh, I just wanted to share that with you today. Again, they're not these aren't the like the greatest settings in the world, but it is that like aimbot type of feel. And uh, I'll make sure to leave a couple clips in a gameplay here if it already hasn't started going post-processing. But let me know what you guys think if you've tried using these settings. And if you did, let me know in the comments uh, what you actually use for it. And maybe I'll try it out and see if, if they're a little bit better than what I'm running with here. And uh, that's it for me. Appreciate all the support. And we'll see you in the next one. Bottom floor. Hit him for 50. Killed him. Is that my portal door? Yep. They took it. Take it back. Killed, uh, bang. Take a portal back. Fuse just hit 60. Cracked him. Oh. On me. Cracked. Got him. Oh, drop on the behind us. I no regs, so many. Oh, fuck. Yeah. Where the fuck is this guy? 
Might be getting pushed. Yep, we got pushed. Oh, fuck. I can You got this. Last one's here. Hey, right here. Still here. Oh, you're better. 